हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू वीक थर्टी वन सो दिस वीक uh the video will be very short because i was mostly busy in writing the journal for a uh special issue so what exactly is a special issue is that when you write for a journal uh they have like a quarterly or semi monthly or maybe yearly submission which varies from journal to journal but many times they have these kind of special themed issues which cover certain range of themes so if you submit for a special issue then if you are lucky sometimes in 6 months or 8 months your paper gets published from the date you send for submission Uh, from the date of the deadline of the submission but if you go for a normal journal sometimes it may be one year sometimes it may be two years sometimes if you are following in twitter follow my profile in twitter you might know so in twitter people post about this kind of academic flaws or you can say like the academic mishappenings like sometimes some journal gets seven or eight years or maybe in worst case seven or eight years or maybe like two years three years to get published but if you have this range of phd for 4 or 5 years then you cannot uh, take this chance of uh, so uh, your supervisors will point this out like which are the journals where you should go for special issue and if you don't find special issue during your time when you produce that work uh, then you might go for this normal submissions but they will be very experienced to point out like these journals have a good reputation of maybe an average publishing rate of maybe one or one and a half years and then you go for that normal journal because you don't have a special issue and it's not always that you have a special issue when you are ready to submit or you are planning to submit a few years ahead uh, before so that's why this was just information i wanted to share but this week i was mostly busy in co- combining that journal maybe in later i'll make a video for people who are going to start new as a phd in netherlands or maybe world over it's the feedback is same based on my experience like how you approach when you start writing a journal and uh, in my case how can you combine previous works uh, short uh, fragments of your work which are unpublished but they were good enough uh, maybe rejected in some conference or some journals and you are combining them to one kind of work uh, for a journal so that may be a topic of a later video where i focus on these issues and how can you combine and make a uh, general article out of it so i hope you like this video if you like it then smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe my channel and keep watching keep sharing for more information about studying and living in netherlands from sambit so till next week peace out